Hi, welcome to my channel. This is Roxy and this is Orcas365 at the Flamingo Gardens on Saturday before the doors open for our orchid show. I'm super excited to be here. This is my home away from home. We are in my town. Um, this is the place where I used to come with my grandparents and my mom when I was a little girl. So it means the world to me to be a vendor here and to be an Orchid Society member here. And I'm just gonna walk you through the process of walking in when you get your ticket back there and then the beautiful displays as we walk towards the orchid show i hope you enjoy and i have i hope you have a lovely easter weekend or a lovely weekend and yeah that's it let's see what they have You're gonna hear a lot of peacocks because this is their place, their happy place. This is not only a beautiful botanical garden, this is also an animal sanctuary. They take in injured animals, um, injured on the road, hit by cars, um, they fly into windows and they nurture them. Sometimes they're able to release them and sometimes they have to just live here forever. So when you pay that um, booth fee, you're actually helping animals get back to the wild or get food and get taken care of since they no longer can fend for themselves so when you pay this ticket to visit here or for the orchid show your money is going to a very very good cause this right here is goals <laughs> if i only had the square footage to do this i would just line my whole house with these um sun vandas and i think i came here for the lego festival with my kids and I, I made a little video and I think these were already here and a lot of them were blooming and a lot of them were not. So, oh my goodness. It is so nice to have this botanical garden all to myself. I can't even explain. I have seen this place evolve. I mean, I have a picture and if I find it, I'm gonna scan it and I'm gonna put it in this video. I was probably about five or six years old and I'm gonna make, I'm gonna attempt to take the picture again in the same spot today or tomorrow. I'm gonna to see if one of my friends will do me the favor to recreate the picture. I think that'll be a lot of fun. What are these? Red cluster sphinx. Oh, sorry guys. Wow, sorry about that. Red cluster figs. Isn't that interesting? They're coming right off of the trunk. Wow, I have never, I mean, I've seen this tree, but I hadn't seen it fruiting and I wonder, they may not be safe to eat. This is amazing. I haven't even got into the orchid festival, you guys. I can be here all day. Well, hello, sir. Hello. How are you doing this morning? Oh my goodness. I'm gonna go the other way because they are doing some landscaping and the noise is gonna ruin the audio. So I'm gonna go ahead and walk this way, guys. They have this beautiful display. I know it's not here all the time, but if you go this way, look at this, you guys. Oh my. There you have a bee, right? But if you start walking this way, which I know I won't be able to do later when there's so many people, it turns into another creature this is absolutely amazing absolutely amazing it's like a cricket now wow microscope i'm gonna try to wow beautiful levon visca british artist So at 9 o'clock the members are going to walk in and then at 9.30 it opens to the public and oh, they were blooming, but they're not. I thought I saw orchids. They're beautiful, beautifully mounted. Oh, I just love this. Sorry guys. 
so I'm trying to get in as much as I can because I am on my own today so I cannot abandon my booth so I wanted to show you before the doors open what we are working with and I love that they have this um photography oh my goodness when the light hits the canopy just right it's beautiful macro photography After you see all there is to see, you enter the orchid show. We are on a loop. There's actually two paths to follow, so I'm just gonna show you. We're having a good time over there. Okay, these, um, these are waiting for their food, so have the rescue animals here any crow anything yes buddy sorry i don't have your food let's admire this beautiful display that the society members took time to make for this show this is absolutely dreamy but dreamy dreamy speechless just take it all in listen to the peacocks i am under the tree over there <laughs> with the peacocks i'll show you that later right now before the doors open i want you to enjoy this serenity no traffic nothing just nature this is totally amazing look at this retusa Goals. I have like a little twig and I can't get her to grow so I'm gonna have to try to get another one and just fill it up right one more because I mean come on to start in some kind of order I'm gonna start on here because I don't know I just I feel like I can keep track of where I'm going so then we have spring water I think the first one and people are setting up and I don't want to bother well well good morning Hello. how are you doing hi how are you I know you're busy but I'm still gonna give you a hug yes I'm gonna give you a hug how are you Doing great. How have you been? <laughs> oh, so busy, but I cannot uh, complain. Good kind of busy. Ooh, that's good. Let me show people. Wow. Wow. Very beautiful flower. The season is coming to the end already, but But um, look at her though. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> beautiful. Thank you. Over 
bán hơn nhiều chứ Chứ không phải vô mà dùng cái mặt kia là đẹp hơn Mà cũng không có lý nhiều Anh biết Anh nhìn, anh nhìn cái hông của bà thì được bông cũng đẹp lắm nhưng mà cái này cũng What? Where? <laughs> I be there. Good <laughs> morning. Somebody said coffee. Oh my god, look. <laughs> he always has the most beautiful announcements. There's a little spot here I don't want to miss. <clears throat> the size of these cat lids. I think this is Odom's. It doesn't, I can't find a sign, but I think it may be Odom's. He's not here yet. It smells amazing here. Oh, okay. We have plant stand which is good because I may need a shelf to put under my new um, structure and then I think here we have uh, everybody's setting up so like I don't I don't want to bother any vendor I just want to give you uh, you know a sneak peek of what we have and we have Broward Orchid Supply here I know I'm gonna go around the loop a few times. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, Sherry. The one and only Gabby. Good <laughs> morning. Look how beautiful you guys to get your Easter gifts here. Look, she has little bunnies. Oh my goodness. Look at that one over there with the orchid. I have three different ones. How cute. And she's still taking out goodies. I'm giving people a sneak peek before they get here. Oh, look at these. These are little maxillarias. And she put them in the. Oh my goodness. Yes, beautiful. I think that one's fragrant too. Yeah. These bunnies. Oh my gosh. And I have a, the, the big one too. Oh, okay. The original Max. That's what I call yeah. that one. Yeah. Que belleza. Very pretty. And look, she has a stingray alocasia. Look, I have one very, very, very little. <laughs> look how big this one is. 
I love those bunnies. Look how cute she does that. Because they're beautiful. Everything you make is beautiful. This is Red Hawk. Red Hawk. Which I haven't been able to meet in any of the shows. So I'm glad that they're here. She's uh, loaded with chocolate orchids and these beautiful species dendrobiums that I have mine in Spike. That's this guy. Very pretty. Similar to mine. The flower may be a little bit bigger. It's more like an antler. So yeah, it's not the one that I have, but it looks like it grows. A thousand? Again, this is Red Hawk. Oh, these are so pretty. I like this one. Very pretty. I should go back to my booth before I spend money that I haven't made yet. Because that's what I'm good at doing, guys. <laughs> Very pretty. How are you? It's a little chilly. We can't complain. So I came here earlier, and this is actually Crow Smith. Not, um, now they have the sign up there. This is where I first stopped this morning and I said that it was uh, spring water, but no, this is Florida Orchid House. So I'm making the correction. So this is where I first walked in in the morning. Look how beautiful and look at those prices. These are steals. Beautiful. And then again, I am one of her number one fans too. Look at this one. $30 and look at the size of that spike. Busted. 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 Now you're on my video shopping. <laughs> uh huh. <laughs> I need to stay away from Carmen because of her. I ended up buying some orchids in Wellington that I wasn't supposed to. But they're really good. Yeah. Yeah. She's good at finding little hidden gems. So. <laughs> Say orchids and bloom booth is always booming with <laughs> blooms. <laughs> no joke. Beautiful. Like a, uh, which one? Oh, look at all those spikes. Ooh, I love how dark those are. Yep. It's a very good price. And look at those. So beautiful. Mm. So really dark. Yeah, I think I have this one. I'm not sure if I have this one yet. I'm going to hear peacocks in my sleep. Oh my goodness, these white are nose wounds. These are the Alba. I think I have two of these already, but mine are small, so since they have so many kikis, I keep on putting them together so that it can look like this. I wonder what the function of the white is. Here is lots of orchids. Okay, <laughs> no worries. 
I bought um so this is lots of orchids this is the one that I bought for the video in the Redlands and it's doing really really good they have a lot a lot of variety when it comes to vandals and species so here we have Sierra Madre which is where my mom buys all her wild fowls and they're setting off they're pretty much just about done I'm going to show you what they have down here and these are the fowls that you see at Yaya's and these are the ones that Yaya is obsessed with the wild fowls tend to grow differently and we're beautiful she also has one of these from him And these are very big and beautiful and 25 is a pretty good price look at the way that the the flower spikes they twist and curl and then she likes to mount her orchids on the trees a lot so they do really well like that and they grow in a way that you want to put them like that this one's beautiful Good morning, how are you, sir? I'm good, thank you. I think I've covered everyone, but I'm gonna do a little walk around. Here we have, I think, the pollinator garden here. Beautiful, beautiful mix of uh, flowers that butterflies and caterpillars love. Good morning. Good morning. And I already did Gabby, and then this is Brendan. I passed by here in the morning make sure that I'm showing you everybody that's here and I remember that one Ooh, I see this one Now I'm gonna fix it. Okay, so I was at Florida Orchid House, but I thought it was spring water. But this is spring water <laughs> because tank cannot stay in one place. So, ooh, look at these, pretty. These are the ones that I since it's Easter, it reminds me of Easter egg, <laughs> like with a yolk. This one's beautiful. This looks. It's giving me like encyclia, encyclia vibes. Let me see. Yeah, it is. Here it is. Very pretty. Put that back in there. Yes, I hear you. I'm going to be hearing peacocks in my sleep for the next three days. This has to be a tenebrosa cross. Yes, it is. Look, I knew it. Anything with tenebrosa, you can tell as soon as you see it. She's pretty. And if that's the price, that's a pretty sweet deal. Look, guys. 35. I'm trying to make me get in trouble here. <laughs> tenebrosa crosses are my weakness. <laughs> oh, yeah, they make the flower a lot bigger. Yes, beautiful. A lot bigger. This one has a, a look like she's upset. <laughs> and then this one 
is this insignia cross right here. It's very, very delicate flower. Very pretty. Look how little. So cute. That's two of those. So this one and the Tenebrosa are my favorite so far. <laughs> Doing good. Nice temperature. Awesome. I would rather be this than cold or hot. <laughs> Okay. See, this is a uh, fritter. How funny now they call it the alien. <laughs> uh, yeah. This is what's getting ready to bloom in my uh, palm tree. from her so I wanted to make sure that I showed all the stuff I love the ventanitas and she has a new one here look how pretty it's longer so she's busy we're not gonna bother her she has her pots and then the spring baskets beautiful Beautiful gift for your fellow gardening friends for Easter. Like people who are collecting orchids, this is um, a kit that comes already prepared for them to, to do a potting and a mounting. This so it brings everything. Genius, Wendy. You like it? <laughs> I love yeah, it. Yeah, they're great gifts to give to, to people who want to, maybe you want to get them to start. Yep. So you've got your bark, you've got your shears, you've got a wooden mount, love gloves, it. you've got fertilizer, you've got That's a rhizome clip. You've I got love everything it. in there. I love everything it. Everything you would need. And all you do is say, here you go, go pick a plant that you would like. Or two, actually, because you have two methods. You You're so smart. So clever. clever. This is my Disney corner. This is my Disney corner. <laughs> so Oh my god, this is a swan, right? It's a swan. Beautiful. Is that a cat? It's a kitty. Why would you do that to me? Julia, Junior. <laughs> and she has an elephant, a heart. You guys, these are really hard to make. And she makes it look easy. Look at this one is beautiful. And I'm obsessed with these kids. For those friends that you want to lure into your hobby, into another rabbit hole, this is like that. This is exactly what you say. Here you go. <laughs> and then she has these cute little seed starter pots. And these, these are perfect gifts for Easter. Her keychains. And the pots that I love for my indoor aroids, everything. So make sure you stop by and say hi to my friend Wendy. Beautiful. Bye everybody. My neighbors are hoyaplants.com and they're located in plantation. And they I'm gonna show you the variety of Hoyas that they have is beautiful. And between the foliage and the blooms. And this one's actually in bud, very big. And then they even have trays that are 15 bucks, like specials, and they, they look really good. This one is very fragrant. I can smell it when I walk past it. And here's the ID, Akuda Green. Very pretty flower and very fragrant. They have a very big variety of Hoyas. I think the only Hoya only vendor that is here in this show. This is the one that I've tried twice and I have failed. I would love to have one of these 
and I'm so scared of not doing it any justice but they do have a few here and they seem to be a bit more established so maybe maybe I'll give it a third try <laughs> that's the only Hoya that hasn't loved me back <laughs> and then they even have this so when you see the IDs you can go through their album and you can see the blooms so that's really helpful Thank you for being a part of my channel and always remember to please be kind. Bye!